It's interesting. When you coach Stanford, you get athletes who, again, they come from parents who may have had their own career and motivations. Is it sometimes more difficult to coach at Stanford because players are bigger, broader, smarter, question you, ask why, Coach Shaw? I think it's a fit. It's the fit for them, but it's also the fit for me. Um, I want to coach bright guys. I want to coach smart guys. And I've heard you say this before. I want to be surrounded by people that know what they're doing and are good at what they do. Um, so I don't mind if a young man says, wait, uh, why are we doing it this way? Because last week we did it a different way. And we say, okay, we're doing it this way because they play a different covers and they play it like this. And now not only is he doing what we told him to do, he understands it so he can do it faster, quicker, and better. Um, so I love that exchange. I love being around bright guys. And I think we put a lot on our guys mentally, and I think our guys can handle it. It's funny. Stanford years ago was thought of as soft, and now you're the opposite. Like everybody's like, oh, Stanford's basically the West Coast version of Alabama. They just play downhill. Do you ever use that as motivation? Come on, brainiacs. They think you're soft. Oh, there's no question. There's no question. I, it's getting harder to do that, though, because I think the, the secret's kind of out that we're not <laughs> soft. Um, but at the same time, I think it's the, the duality of this place, which is we want to be brilliant. We're surrounded by very intellectual people that are, that are going to do something beyond football, special in our, in our world. But at the same time, when it comes down to it, we're going to run the power play uh, right, right at you and, and be physical and try to push you out of the way. So I think that duality makes this place special.